On December 12, 1882, in Duluth, Minnesota, a poor French Canadian named Camille Poyer patented a new type of pack sack that could carry all provisions needed for a long adventure. It was a canvas sack that closed with a buckled flap, had newfangled shoulder straps in addition to the traditional tump line, a revolutionary sternum strap, and an umbrella holder. Known then as the Poyer Pack, this Northwoods classic is referred to today as the original Duluth Pack. Stepping into the Duluth Pack Shop in Duluth, Minnesota is like stepping back in time. Each of the sewers specialize in their own products and sees their product from start to finish. Um, I do packs and customs repairs and alterations. Right now I'm working on a pack that's probably about 40 years old. We've had 75 year old packs that needed, you know, just a patch or maybe a new leather strap or buckle. And I mean, people just won't, won't let them go. We've asked ourselves quite a few times why don't people just throw it away and buy a new one, but sometimes they're handed down to a generation after generation. Um, they become like a family member, they get really attached to them. I think people should know how much care and uh, hard work goes into the making of these bags um, because they're not just a regular bag. They're not like uh, most of the other bags available on the market today. You'll find the sewer's initials or name on each and every Duluth pack bag. It makes you feel good. You know, somebody's going to look at that bag and say, hey, you made it. You made this bag. Oh yeah, I'd love to know where a lot of them end up. You know, they go all over the country, probably the world. You know, yeah, it'd be fun to see where a lot of them end up. How people like them, how people use them, you know. The leather and canvas used is cut carefully by hand and assembled with hand-pounded rivets, ensuring the greatest durability. They hit my fingers quite often actually, but I've learned to stay away from that now. You get better as you go. What do you say when you hit your fingers? Uh, can't say that on camera. <laughs> <laughs> All of the Duluth Pack craftsmen and women take pride in their work, and they know what it takes to produce a quality product. Well, first of all, there's, we have packs that weigh, I think, 13 pounds, and we have to wrestle them around all day long, get them through this little tiny hole or a slip machine. No. <laughs> 20, 30 years down the road, if something ever does go wrong with the pack, which it shouldn't, but if it does, uh, it, it will be fixed for free, which is, which is great. So you can expect the same lasting quality and craftsmanship that they're known for after 125 years. Over the years, Duluth Pack has been changing products and creating new ones altogether. Duluth Pack now makes everything from their traditional canoe and camping packs to business and travel gear, school packs, book bags, and more. For 125 years, they've been a trusted household name. One thing is for certain, there's only one Duluth Pack. Visit us in Canal Park in Duluth, Minnesota, or online at www.duluthpack.com.